Thank you very much, Mr. President, uh, for inviting us here. The last time the three of us met was at the Global Gateway Forum in Brussels three months ago. And now we're putting our words into action. Um, so thank you very much for welcoming us here. Um, we have gathered a very impressive group around the table. So it is the European Business and Energy Electrolyzers and Steel, but also the European Investment Bank. And the fact that the three of us are here and the whole government is here shows the importance of today's uh, event. We have come together with one shared purpose. We want to build a green hydrogen ecosystem right here in Mauritania. And indispensable for such an endeavor, such a task, is predictability. And you, Mr. President, launched in 2020 the National Energy Transition Strategy. It's a coincidence, but exactly at the same time, at the beginning of 2020, we launched the European Green Deal. The European Green Deal is our ambitious strategy to be climate neutral by 2050, uh, while growing our clean and circular economy. And one part in this economy is green hydrogen. So to give you two figures, uh, the European Union, we want to produce 10 million tons of green hydrogen by 2030 domestically. But we also know that we have to import another 10 million tons of green hydrogen by 2030. So we have to work very hard domestically, but we also need partners abroad. And to facilitate this shared ambition outside Europe, we have created the investment plan that you're very familiar with, uh, with, which is Global Gateway. Global Gateway will mobilize up to 300 billion euros uh, worldwide for sustainable and high quality projects in partner countries. And here now comes Mauritania into play. As you've said, Mauritania is blessed with resources, that is space, it is wind, it is sun. And with the right investment and infrastructure, this country can harness over 350 gigawatts of renewable energy only from wind and sun. But that's not all. Mauritania is also Africa's second largest iron producer. And the majority of your iron is exported as raw ore. But if we have clean energy coming into the game, the processing into green steel could stay here in Mauritania. And that's a huge step because this is the added value. This is where the jobs are. This is where the prosperity is. So in fact, you could export iron and premium green steel. The technology works. But as I said, the production of green steel needs an essential input, and that is green hydrogen. And this is why hydrogen is so important for Mauritania, but also for Europe. So we share the interests. And it would be a source domestically um, of revenue and as export product, for example, to the European Union. Now, our Team Europe initiative, um, that is Spain, that is Germany, that is France, with the European Union and the European Investment Bank, we're all here um, to support. And I would like to thank you all. I would very much like to thank the European companies that are present here um, and represented by Hydrogen Europe. We know each other very well. Europe is stepping in with Global Gateway. And we are in for the long term. That is important. Because demand for Mauritania's green hydrogen and potentially green steel will set to grow exponentially in the European single market. We know already the demands that are out there, so if you step into that business field, we know that uh, this is an excellent business case. And with that, it is important that the European Union supports in building the infrastructure, Team Europe, the, to train the local workforce. I think this is what the companies are looking for and what they are waiting that will create local jobs, but also to establish the legal framework. So a conducive framework for the private sector to
to do what you know best. <laughs> Develop the project. You're good at that. So we can be good at uh, all the other topics like training uh, the, the workforce or um, creating a conducive environment and, of course, building uh, the infrastructure. So I'm very glad um, that we can he be here today. It is a win-win-win situation, and we should join forces because the project is fascinating. Many thanks. <laughs>